So I'm going to share what I'm putting in Easter baskets this Easter for 2024. Um, do excuse the mess in the background. That is obviously all Easter gifts, so I could do this video. Um, I haven't been well for the last few days, admittedly. I had another funeral and was out of town. So um, some of these um, videos will be out of order. But I wanted to put this one up because else I'm going to get quite late as I have not done my tour. I've been laid up for the last couple of days. So I'm going to start off with me granddaughter's basket. And... You know me, I like to buy things when they're on sale. And I bought this, um, I don't know if it was spring or summer last year. I did not pay this. I think I paid, because it says £6 from B&M, but I, I've got it down as I paid £3. So that's the reason why I look out for these things. I have not included sweets and chocolates, which you might be disappointed in, but hey-ho, we're all trying to be a bit more healthy these days a lot of things i have bought on sale so i'm going to quickly go through it some of the prices i probably won't go into due to the fact it is in previous hauls like i said this i got from b&m um i've got i've put one of them i've got quite a few of these um different gnomes so we've got that one all gonks um i got this little bear one or rabbit should i say not bear rabbit um, they came from Timu, I think, especially the rabbit. So I need to do this fairly quickly because we're supposed to be going out. I've cancelled our Easter um, do actually because I haven't been 100%. I haven't had a chance to go and do shopping or anything or cleaning. And I've got this little notepad. This was actually 97p from the range. Again, you know, on sale. I've got this pencil case. You'll notice that a lot of them are like activities and things. Um, and I think that was something like 85 or 95 pence. And um, in here, we've got some stickers. They will probably be about the same price, about 80 pence. Um, we've got this Love You Niece. This is from her uncle Daniel. This was from the um, works for 50 pence. Because um, she's getting a little bit older. So uh, hopefully she'll have at least a chance to read this one now because I've kept hold of it. We cancelled last Easter. This one I got, I think it was from It's a Gift. This was £1.50, age six and over. Connect the dots, 100 activities. So I thought that would be really good. I don't think we often see dot to dot books, but I thought that would be really good. And it has age six and over. I've got a, a Peter Rabbit 2 on Blu-ray. I know there's a lot here because I do put pocket money aside and I've been I've been collecting this over the last 12 months. We've got a rabbit sort of lunch bag as normally I would have put snacks and things in there. Um, she's got the owl t-shirt which I think I've hauled. Some things I might not have. She's got the stickers and what you do, you've got the, um, there's quite a few in there. And then you can put the accessories on and the faces. We've got Nighttime Bunny Book. And then, um, so some of these things I've got after Easter um, reduced. Got this Hello Bunny um, sort of little canvas to colour. Um, we've got the dress here, the, um, which is I think I did actually um, pull that from Timu. We've got some more stickers here. So some of these I'll probably take out the polythene. And what else have we got in here? Some notelets. And we've got a little bag purse. This has got the strap inside. And I thought with the yellow and like the rabbit. And then we've got the rabbit pen. And we've got a couple of macaroon pots. And in here is a bracelet and a watch. Now, I know this seems an awful lot, but like I said, I put pocket money aside for her and a lot of things were on sale. So I'll go through some of the other things that I am including for Easter. 
So because we are not having a party, I'm going to take some of the eggs and we're going to put some of these rings in at our house. Um, say I haven't got a lot of energy. Um, I haven't been eating very well the last few days as well. So there's going to go in some Easter eggs. We're also taking Easter bingo and the placemats and coats. So that's a few items actually that were in the Easter box to go. Um, for my daughter-in-law, I like getting these bags, especially from Poundland to use. And she has got these um, sort of furry um, scrunchies um, for the hair. Um, I'm including the Easter nails and also she's got pajamas. And then my eldest son, again, a bag from Poundland Gaming One. And he has got the gaming um, cushion cover. I try and um, put things that I know they'll use or need. Then I'm sending both of the T-shirts. I was going to keep one up, but I think he mentioned that he was getting short on T-shirts. So I'm going to send both of those. They're both the whatever t-shirts and they um, go tie-dye down the bottom. So one is black to grey and the other one is like that orangey colour. And then I got that from Primark because he likes his Minecraft keyring. Um, so that is it so far. I've got my um, other son's basket but I'll include that um, in a little while. So I have been sorting out my gift wardrobe, but to finish the um, sort of Easter gifts off, this is um, Daniel's basket or bag. I'm doing them at a gamers only bag. I told you that I tend to get these from different shops like Poundland and everything because I find these are really nice to keep in as um, gifts as well. He's also got a um, cushion cover to go in the games room. Um, he's also got the mat very similar to this and also he has also got a key ring that I got from Primark he's got Superman because we're always into Marvel and DC all our family is I've also got the games room which looks like a um, number plate um, I got that from Timu yes a lot comes from there and so does these t-shirts so I've got I've actually hauled these previously sorry i missed your call i was on the other line and then this one i'm a multitasker i can listen ignore and forget all at the same time so that's what's going into daniel's basket or like i said bag um i do tend to probably purchase a fair bit for easter but then again um family know that I've cancelled my do um, on Easter Sunday because I haven't been 100% and I've had another funeral to go to this week so uh, it's just been quite a stressful time so hopefully you've enjoyed this video thanks for watching goodbye